Hey, hey, down, down, down. Sit down. Everybody must die. So when and how, we don't know. That is the day which has been determined. It will just come naturally if it comes, I don't know. But I never thought about it. The people are dangerous. They'll be looking for you, but they'll also try to avoid you because they don't know how dangerous also you are. Ah, this job is not for the I painted man. You must be very strong and be committed. If not committed, uh, you will never kill us. Because we are living now in the field for a long time. As you have seen yesterday when we were moving throughout the night, what were you doing? Yeah, when they come in, they just come in just before last light, just before sunset. Yeah, when they come in, they spot the animal. When it's about to be dark, then they kill the animal. Then they leave it. Just before first light in the morning, that's when they chop off and they exit the park. So those are the timings that we must check for, especially that's when they're active. Yeah, my seven is As if humanity in yourself. Even if you can fight with a person today, tomorrow, you must carry on with the task at hand. You forgot about that. You focus on double caps and the trucks, uh, cool ten trucks. Uh, yes. Okay. Then we quick, we uh, hit, we go. Uh, they change uh, their tactics time and again. As you can see, I've closed this area that I was expecting them. Then they diverted to other, other position. But currently, I'm going to, to close this gap. Uh, tonight, I'll be closing this gap and wait again. No, no, here you don't sleep. <laughs> the rest, you, you don't sleep during the night. During the night, they wake. Every night. <laughs> it's important for me to wake. That's what I'm paid for, to wake. In this border, to protect the border. To me, it's just a part of my life because I love this job. So it's probably about 30 degrees Celsius. Each member is carrying their R4 assault rifle and um, body armor, which weighs about 10 to 12 kilograms. And when I say we are walking, we're not walking as much as we are marching. This is late for the airport, fast pace with the trolley kind of walk. With 20 kilograms of luggage attached to your body to give you some perspective. And it's far. In this heat, in this terrain, yeah, it's not a Sunday stroll. You ought to be dedicated. Be always working. As you have seen last night, uh, we work till 12. Now from 4 o'clock also this morning we are out also looking for some illegal things which are happening because this is a hot spot whereby they hide the vehicles which are crossing to a neighboring country. There are many, many routes. In fact, there are many routes. Now like we are just taking the, the important routes where 
where they are passing because they pass here most of the time. Most of them you can see the road is like it's busy, it's a busy road. We can see the people on the border, they just they noticed us and they are just standing there for us to shift the position then they will cross again. The, the my mandate doesn't allow me to cross over into the border because they are still on their countryside. So once they are this side of South Africa, then they have crossed the, the border illegally. That's where now I can do the arrest. troops in, 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 uh, in each and every space. So some of the spaces must close with the obstacles and then we know that uh, we deploy our people in strategic pos positions that can cover those routes coming in here. Born in Mozambique or born in South Africa? No. But you've got the citizen and ID. Or the fact is because the young lady, Agana ID. Agana ID. That's hello. Best passport. Agana passport. Passport. When I was patrolling with you, you have seen uh, there was one who was having an infant. Uh, you apprehend, you take her back to the SAPS for deportation, and uh, you will see again within three, four hours, she will be back in, into the country.